In this lesson, we're going to learn the palm front strike. So palm front strike is where you come out this way and strike an opponent directly in front of you. So from a walking stance, we're going to start with the hand back, the usual position. Hand is open. And from here, we're going to come out. We're going to turn the wrist. And we're going to come out this way here. Hand open. Make sure your fingers are tight together. Your thumb is in at the side here. Don't tuck it underneath like this. Keep it at the side. And then come out like this, directly out in front of you. So this is palm front strike. So from here, back, and then out, just like this. And you notice that there's there's a subtle turn of the wrist and the hand as it comes out. So remember, we can do this technique both regular palm front strike and we can do reverse palm front strike. Either way, we're striking an opponent that is directly in front of us. We're going solar plexus level once again with this technique. So whether you do it regular or reverse, that is the target. Okay? So looking at that from the side, palm front strike. It's also important, a little bit of a snap at the finish too. So when you strike, strike and kind of retract slightly. So hit and pull back. So in reverse, hit and pull back slightly. So you've, you've already hit the target long before you get out to here, to full extension. You're not striking the target way out here. You're already hitting the target in close, right? This is, pe people ask, what is the benefit or why would you use a palm strike when we already have punch for a technique? So if we had reverse middle punch or regular middle punch, why would we want to strike with the palm? And there's a few reasons. Using the palm, there's less that can go wrong with that strike. So with a punch, everything has to be just perfect. If your hand or your wrist is slightly out of position, there's a pretty good chance that you're going to break your hand or break your wrist when you do the technique, if you do it improperly. With a palm strike, there's a lot less that can go wrong when you're coming in and hitting with the palm. And this is the striking tool right here, what we call uh, the palm base, the bottom of the palm. You're not striking with the fingers, you're not striking with the whole palm, you're striking with the bottom of the palm, this area down here. It's typically called the palm base, you know, base of the palm. One of the advantages of this technique is you can strike opponents that are close range to you. Very, very close range. So if somebody is right in my face here, too close for me to be able to get off a proper punch, I can still get them with a palm strike. Because you look at, you look at the arm and you can see that I'm able to generate power already at this short range here almost to the point where somebody is almost touching me, they're that close to me, I can still generate power and strike that opponent with a palm strike, even at extremely close range, where a punch wouldn't be practical. So palm strike lets you get in there and hit opponents that are very close to you. Of course, you're giving up reach with a palm strike because you can see with a fist, 
I have this much more reach with a fist than I do with a palm. So my opponent has to be closer to me to be able to hit them. Uh, another advantage with a palm strike is it is a very powerful strike. Palm strike is probably the most powerful uh, hand technique that you can do in martial arts. So if you strike somebody like this with a palm strike, this is extremely powerful, extremely damaging. You can, you can do massive damage with a palm strike. It's very, very powerful. So, um, very powerful technique and very effective at close range. So, remember in walking stance, we can do this technique either regular or we can do it reverse. So, regular palm strike would be like this. Okay? Reverse palm strike, opposite hand, opposite foot. Okay. Looking from the side, reverse palm strike. like a slap, but you're actually using the palm, not the fingers, that would be a palm side strike. So when I say palm strike, I'm referring to coming in and striking straight forward at the target as if it was like a middle punch. So coming straight out, and again, notice, notice the twist and getting the hand into position as it comes out. So when it starts, it's almost like your palm is facing towards you and then you turn it and come out. Right? Almost like you, you start with your palm facing towards you and then you twist and come out with it this way. So, but very important, keep the fingers together and keep your thumb at the side. Don't tuck it underneath like this when you're doing palm string. So, Practicing a few of those by count. We'll do reverse palm strike.